Ah, Copperdale High, a school so bland you'll likely give up on all your hopes and dreams the second you step foot inside. Thankfully, we're here to change that, and hopefully make high school gameplay more engaging for you in the process. We're going to look at 9 ideas to help make Copperdale High School more fun to play in. Of course, these ideas are just suggestions, and you are welcome to pick and choose what you'd like to include in your own high school, or even build upon or adapt ideas to suit your tastes and play style. Also, if you have any ideas of your own, then please feel free to let me know in the comments down below. Let's kick things off with renovating the school gym. It's located in the school's basement, and if your sim wasn't very sad when they walked through Copperdale High School's front doors, then they will be when they enter the gym. Seriously, it feels like whoever furnished this was under an 8 second time limit, or something crazy like that. I would suggest making the gym bigger, and not hesitating to remove the awkward computer room or the strange chess room, we're not here for them. While the gym doesn't have to have everything, it can be nice to add solo cheerleading mats, or even group cheerleading mats if you make the room big enough, as this ties in really nicely with high school activities. I also added in punching bags, weight machines, and treadmills just so that there was a little bit more going on. Some music can be great too, because we all love the option to have a bit of pump up music going while we throw our pom poms. The next idea ties in closely with the first, and it's to add a pool that closely mimics a lap pool. To get this effect, I added in lane markers inside the pool, as well as a clock on the wall that looks kind of like the clocks they use to run swimming drills. As I did swimming squads all through high school myself, I personally know the pain that these clocks cause, but that's for another day. While we're here, I'm also going to throw out my plea to the universe, also known as The Sims Team, to add in some lane ropes to the game. Please and thank you. But just in general, I really like having a school pool as it can help bring to life teenage sims who are swimmers and kind of adds another high school sporting activity. It can also add some good gameplay, like maybe your sims want to head on over for a fun dip after they finish class. If you go down this path, then adding change rooms can complement this really well, because we don't have time to be smelling like chlorine all day. I mean, it's going to mess up your sims' proposals. Well, not actually, but... Yeah, let's keep going. The third idea is to create club rooms. Now, if you have the Get Together expansion pack, then you can align these to actual clubs, making spaces that are exclusive to those who are in a club by locking the door for all those outside of it. But if you don't have Get Together, then you can still make club spaces, just they won't be as exclusive. The options are almost endless here, but I made a gaming space where sims who love buttons and screens can hang out and play online together. I also made a queer space for members of the LGBT plus community, which is something that I wish I had during high school myself. I really liked this as just a relaxed, inclusive space where sims could chat, hang out, play games and have tea. The options are seriously endless though, like now that we have reasonably sized telescopes, you could make a science or astronomy club. On to a quick but important idea, which I'm going to call giving the school a general aesthetic upgrade. The idea here being just to elevate the very boring or very bland parts of the school, and flooring is a big one. The Copperdale tiles have heaps of intricate trim options that much to the detriment of my serotonin levels are barely used throughout the school. You can add a lot more interest to every area and make your eyes happier through some creative flooring. Likewise, the carpets are rather ugly, and I know that this is realistic. Nobody here has looked at a school carpet and been wowed. But friends, let's elevate a bit. Just because a lot of schools use fugly carpet, it doesn't mean that we have to. We can be better. We are better. Admittedly, The Sims team hasn't given us heaps of carpet options, and I went to the honeycomb carpet from Discover University. That being said, even the embossed carpet from the base game is an upgrade. On top of this, adding a few more seats and school banner stands to hallways can help bring the school scene to life. There was a lot of dead space upstairs too, so I added little group study spaces sectioned off with half walls. I also moved the easels to the weird dead end balcony areas, and I must say these balcony areas are an intriguing design choice. Intriguing could be a euphemism. Now let's walk with purpose and confidence into the fifth idea, being to create a debating room. 
This will require the Discover University Expansion Pack and it can be as simple as popping down a Debaters Podium set accompanied by a few seats. This type of room can really bring debating as a school activity to life and it could even tie in nicely with a debate club that you could make if you have the Get Together Expansion Pack. On to the sixth idea, which is to revamp and improve the music room. Once again, whoever created this was given an 8 second deadline. Like I quite literally think they put 5 objects in the whole room. I know, the level of effort is keeping me awake at night as well. I honestly just did a bit of rearranging to the space and added a few more instruments here, notably the Digirad keyboard and a few guitars. I also added in a few rugs and hung up some musically themed artwork and bam, I could once again sleep happily at night. We're heading into the cafeteria now and we both know that what the Sims team delivered here was not the iconic high school musical stick to the status quo cafeteria scene that we deserve. It was not. No one is coming to this cafeteria for a good time. But we're going to change that by giving it an upgrade. Now honestly, I think this space is a bit too big. So I gave it a little section off with half walls. I also added in a few more tables too, because having just three tables for an entire school didn't feel right. Then I made the sectioned off area a place to add some social games. Admittedly, I did lean on expansion packs here, adding in foosball tables from Get Together, as well as the table tennis table from Discover University. If you just have the base game, then you could consider game tables here instead. Overall, it gives the space a lot more purpose, which in my opinion is much needed. Honestly though, I kept thinking of cafeteria movie scenes where people eat lunch in the toilet, and before the revamp, I must say that would have been the preferred option because it was just such a bad cafeteria. Now for the eighth idea, we're going to revamp the school's study space which is another one of the rooms that have been furnished in mere seconds. I popped in a few extra bookshelves, desks with computers, and I also added in research machines from the Discover University Expansion Pack 2, which tie in quite nicely. On top of this, I also added a few chess sets, moving them in here rather than having them in that strange room in the basement. Making a larger school library is another option that can work very nicely so definitely feel free to take this further and go beyond just a bit of an all-purpose study space. Now the final idea is just to breathe a bit more life into the outdoor playground. To do this, I added in a basketball ring as well as painting murals from the City Living Expansion Pack. I just felt these could be quite fun and a little bit edgy, and also when I make my very own Troy Bolton, he is going to need a basketball ring. Though now I'm thinking he needs a proper gymnasium with a full basketball court and a concert hall too for his performance. So, you know, watch this space. Back on track, and even adding in a few footballs outside can make the playground more appealing and social, and if you have Discover University, then soccer balls are a quick and easy win as well. And with that, we're at the end. That's 9 ideas to improve Copperdale High, because we all know that the school needs it. If you have any ideas of your own, then please feel free to let me know in the comments down below. Also, if you enjoyed or found this helpful, then please subscribe and leave a like. I would really appreciate it, and have an amazing day. See you later!